Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial with me, You Are a Monkey. Today we are doing a tutorial for the office that you are seeing in front of you now. If you have ever wanted an office that includes a computer, some crazy monkey sitting on a desk, and somewhere to do some painting, this is the spot for you. Stay tuned and I will give you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to complete all of this. So first we're going to start off with a gravestone. This will be our computer monitor. And then we'll grab a feeding trough and we'll clip it right in between these two pillars here. And then we will take a table and place it inside it, just like that. And we're going to grab a metal wall sign, place it just like this so it looks like a keyboard. And then we're going to grab two more feeding troughs and extend our desk to the right. And then of course we'll place two tables inside to create our work surface. And now we'll grab a chair, place it right in the corner and we'll grab a bench and place one right here. Now grab a bookshelf and then we'll place three cryo fridges. And we're just going to adjust this one because it's really bothering me that it wasn't straight. So over at the desk I realized that I forgot to put in uh, the leash which looks like a mouse. So we're going to put that in now. So pick up that and then we're going to place this and then we got to make sure that we deactivate it so we don't have that red ring shining everywhere. And then just replace the feeding trough and the table and we're good to go. And now we're going to make our little painter's area. So in order to prop up the canvas, you gotta use a mortar and pestle and you just place it like this and then it will tilt. And then we're gonna take another mortar and pestle and hide the little knob thing and leave the bowl out so it looks like you have a paintbrush. And now we'll grab two small crop plots and we'll place them exactly like this. Now we're gonna grab some tech catwalks and we're gonna place two of them across here. And then we're going to start decorating the top of this. So we'll need a couple crop pots and a small box and we'll get those placed. And now, just because we're feeling fancy, we're gonna place a fish basket. Now we're gonna go over into the left corner and we're going to place a lamp post just sort of tucked inside the pillar there. And then we're gonna start placing our taxidermies. You can do whatever taxidermies you want. I like to do the, the boss monkey and a whole bunch of the other monkeys just cause, you know, I'm a monkey. You can make some really cool scenes with the taxidermies. I've made a whole bunch of like fighting scenes where you have like a T-Rex and a pack of aloes or something like that. You can always come up with some crazy, crazy ideas. They're fun to work with, play around with them. So now we're going to place a tech light. This is going to go underneath our desk so that it's nice and bright. So we'll place a feeding trough and then we're going to stretch this out. It's going to be 
two and a half long, essentially. So we're gonna place this in the window and then we're gonna place another one in between those two. And then now we can place tables inside. And now we'll place a bench just like this and a chair on the other side. Now grab some more benches. We're gonna place them up top so it looks like a little shelf. And then we'll add some vessels on the end for all the fanciness. And now we'll add an artifact pedestal and we'll add in a trophy. And now we'll place three of these trophy mounts just like this. And we'll paint them up and throw on some cool boss heads. And now we'll get our rug on. Hashtag shag rugs. Hashtag I love shag rugs. And now that we have these done, it's time to make sure that our plants will be able to get some water. So we're gonna throw in some irrigation. Uh, I'm gonna ghost to do this. You do not have to ghost. You can do this totally legit. You can slide it into the pillar there and just go on the outside and then you can place your irrigation taps and whatnot and it will work. You can also hide them just on the inside of the pillars, like not directly inside, but like in a corner of it. But that's enough about irrigation pipes. And we'll just make sure that the ones up top are also irrigated now. And yes, they are, perfect. So now we'll go back over to the left-hand side. We're gonna place a large crop plot. We're gonna stick it through that window slightly because we're gonna have another crop plot on the other side. And then we're gonna take a medium crop plot. We're gonna place it in the center of this. And when we go and place our plant seeds and fertilizer in there, it should look really cool. So now we're gonna grab another trophy mount and we're going to grab one of the shields and we're going to paint it and then we'll place it on this trophy mount. And that will do it. And now what you have should look like this. That's gonna be the end of this tutorial. I hope you stick around to wait for the other tutorials that are coming out. There will be one on the living room upstairs and the bedroom. So make sure to stay subscribed and keep your eye out for those. Again, thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time. Have a great day.